in as much as this uh uh wives will uh, get male children for them also anti beauty and anti calabash in as much as they try to remind him that their children are still male child and that if uh, Queen Naomi does not want to return to the palace, that Kabiyesi should not bother himself that they have their own sons who can always represent any time, any day. Yes, that if Queen Naomi, according to what we hear, they are telling Kabiyesi that he should forget about uh, 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 Queen Naomi. He should stop begging Queen Naomi because we now hear that Kabiyesi is using the strategy of Tadenikawu to enter Queen Naomi. That uh, he wants to seek Tadinikawo. Tadinikawo is his uh, blood, is his uh, life, is his everything that he cannot do without Tadinikawo. So, as if they sing a song every time, they say these women, they were not happy about this. As they, they tell Kabiesi, my lord, will you want to buy yourself over one child? What about us? What about our, our boys? What about the sons we give you? What about the more children that are yet to come into the palace? Why are you not buying yourself over just one boy, just one son? Why are you not looking at these children that are flying, that are uh, doing, you know, the playing all over the, the palace? Why, why don't you see princes in them and princesses in them? Why don't you see the fisher in them? Why don't you invest in them the way you are investing to Tadenikawo, my people? Hmm. They say that is the, the, the advice they are giving to KBAC, that even some of the elders self. Where this alone is done, bribe. They still they follow the tech KBAC. Make you know they worry about Tadenikawo. Say if Tadenikawo, if Kenomi does not want to bring Tadenikawo to the palace, that Tadenikawo, that is it, uh, Kenomi's loss. That if eventually Tadenikawo does not inherit anything from inside the palace, that that is Tade, uh, Kenomi's loss. And nobody could be, nobody would go blame KBAC. Kabiyesi will not be blamed because he tried his best. And them also, they know that he, he tried his best. So that he should stop buying himself over Tadenikawo as if Tade is the only son that he has and that he doesn't have another son or that he may not likely have other children. That children will come, that plenty of children will come into this palace and Kabiyesi will enjoy as plenty of children as possible. My people, they say this is the advice, the elders, where the soloris go don't buy with one bag of rice and one yam. The, the advice where did they give Kabiyesi? But we hear say Kabiyesi, don't you hear about these things? Especially the time where we hear say uh, uh, Kwenomi travel to with a uh, baby with uh, Tade Nikawo. Nine days uh, that's gone, they tell Kabiyesi, say, see now, the person where you they buy for, the person where you they buy for, now your mama no even won't make, give you information. Now your mama they carry him, they fly up and down. And no court where you go now we go grind you the custody of that child because he is still very small. So they can't they encourage Kabi AC that to, he should just forget about Tade and discourage him also from uh, 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 taking care, taking charge, taking care of Kenomi and Tade Nikawo. That if Kenomi thinks that he can, she can take care of Tade Nikawo, that she should go ahead. By the time where she go hear him, eh, she Kabi AC go, she go run. They follow KBC for Nyash, they beg KBC for proper care to take care of his son, Tade Nikawo. That make KBC just come more eye from Tade for now. Since Kwenomi does not want anybody to talk to her, since Kwenomi is now doing as she wants, since she's not flying anywhere she wants to go without even uh, regarding KBC, that KBC should just let her be and forget about Tade. That if she stays like one month or two months without hearing KBC talk about Tade Nikawo, that he uh, Kwenomi is going to beg Kabiyesi. So they say after telling Kabiyesi these things, Kabiyesi thought of this over and over and over again and called them a meeting. In that meeting, Kabiyesi told them, enough is enough. Nobody should advise me anymore concerning Tadene Kawo. They said Kabiyesi made it points clear, pop and clear, pop and plain that Kabi, uh, Kwen, uh, uh, Tadene Kawo is his only legitimate, he puts legitimate there. So that this alone is waiting, say, Kabi is no, no, waiting in the do. So that they go, no, say, Kabi is really no, waiting in the do. They said, Kabi is told them, This is my legitimate son. I and Tade are inseparable. I cannot trade him for anything. He is the crown prince, and he is the only one who is even worthy of me. 
he is my only biological legitimate son. And it is me that said it. Yeah. Even though I have other children, they say, Kabi, see the talk, say, even though he has children, he loves them also. He loves them equally, but nobody should talk anything ill about Tade Nikawo. That Tade Nikawo is, is his crown prince, and Tade Nikawo is his legitimate son, and the love of his life is Queen Naomi. And nobody, that even if he and Queen Naomi does not continue tomorrow, that he will always be there for them, and will always take care of Tade Nikawo. That Tade Nikawo is his right hand man and he cannot trade him for anything. He cannot leave him like that. That he wouldn't want any man to spend a dime on uh, 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 Tade Nikawo. So that he, that is why he will be doing everything possible to see that he, he takes care of Tade. At least he will know in his conscience that whatever money that Kenomi is spending on Tade Nikawo. He will know that he's the one that is providing for it. They said he shunned the elders and asked them to shut up and never ever refer or make any statements concerning Tade Nekawo and Kwe Naomi. If they don't have anything good to say, they should just sit down and mind their business. And to the Oloris, where things say Kabi AC would uh, leave, uh, uh, he told uh, uh, Antigua and, uh, sorry, Antigua and Antigua, uh, uh, Calabash and Anti Beauty that they said Anti Calabash was later informed what he said that no matter what children they gave him, no matter how many children they gave him, that they can never be compared to Tade Nikawo. That Tade Nikawo brought him open doors of children of male child, Tade Nikawo brought him luck, Tade Nikawo brought him a lot of healing, Tade Nikawo is special and graced. They say the elders were shocked. That KBAC that was, you know, was flowing with them, all of a sudden by the mention, you know, these are the same elders that are advising KBAC to take the, to take more wives, you know. So and KBAC was flowing with them, planning on how to take a new wife, according to what we hear. Before Parupo said that he will not support that, KBAC brother said he will not support that, and that the only thing that will make them support him is for him to free Queen Naomi. And KBAC does not also want to free Queen Naomi. So these elders, they, were, they, they don't they advise him since. And he was work, already working according to their, uh, their advice. Until they mentioned Tade, he now have to open eye for them and told them that, no, 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 not where Tade is. Whatever you say, I might accept, I might consider. But you see this one, don't you ever mention Tade Nekawo. Don't you ever speak ill of Tade Nekawo. Because Tade is my rightful son, is my legitimate son, is my photocopy, is my everything. He's my word. And I can never trade him for anything. I cannot trade him for 100 children. If it is only him, let it be only him. Instead of Tade to move out of this palace, let these other children move out of the palace. My people, them shock. As the Oloris now heard this, uh, that we said instead of Tade to move, then let other children move out of the palace. My people, they said the Oloris, eh, this, in, eh, this one, it shocked them for Bodio. At least, eh, they're going to say, ah, KBS don't drop message for them. Oh. May they mind their tongue go, may they mind the way they talk. Or them and their children. Not only say, say them come out, their children go also follow them come out from inside the palace of KBS. So now the matter where they fly around as these women, at least they go think about their life. They go really sit down, think well, well about their life. My people will be bringing you more updates. Please kindly subscribe to this channel. Do not forget to give the video a thumbs up. And don't forget that all these are alleged information. I will be right back.